Here we are once again, my fellow gamers. Welcome back to 1940 Germany in the excellent early access title, Uberlaufer. And uh, this title, you play a uh, Wehrmacht soldier, German soldier, who's defecting, and you have to find your way out of a procedurally generated dungeon, fulfill a certain number of tasks, and then there's secondary tasks that are open to you, such as uh, finding um, prisoners of war or collecting items to carry out of the dungeon with you for additional points. So let's get in. Now I've passed one mission, and I don't know what happens if there's a second. Now when I play, I'm basically in here to find prisoners and uh, get them out. I think that's the most fun thing to do. Each time you play, it creates a, generates a character for you. All right. Now this time, it's black and white. And stop. Your brave challenge to the Nazi agenda has not gone unnoticed. Like you, we are a group of fellow Germans who detest this regime and long for an end to this terror and bigotry. We've opened your cell and left you this gun. Do not lose it. It was the best we could manage with the SS hunting us down. Bullets are scarce in the castle dungeon, so use them sparingly. When you can, knock the guards out from behind. The more noise you make, the more likely you are to attract the attention of the SS. We desperately need your help retrieving a number of items to aid in the resistance effort. Search everywhere. Good luck. Okay, and so this tattoo on our wrist will fade away as we lose our health and the ring around it will show a green, yellow or red highlight uh, showing the amount of detection they've uh, got on us at the time. The handgun's got a new light feature. You hold, press down on the stick and hold, and there's the light. It's got a nice little volumetric amount at the front there. Looks cool. Unfortunately, they've got the um, gun placement in the center of the chest, which kind of makes no sense. Should always be on the hip. All right, in this area, you can use the credits that you've got from your previous games to buy items. I'm not sure if they stick with you or not. These items are for one mission only, I believe. If you turn your hand over, this appears. That's kind of your backpack. A soul bush is a book, apparently. It shows your character, some information about the guy shows your objectives so i need a gold key tactical map and some military magazines and to take a photograph of an enemy soul an enemy guard dead or alive it's tell me right here the statistics of what i picked up and what i've got so far here is a very primitive map starting with this room we're in here now i'm the little dot as we go along, the map will fill out. There's multiple levels to these dungeons. It could be a massive area, massive area. So uh, let's get started. Stalic. Very interesting. Okay, black and white. Quite a moody game. Gotta dig that. Gotta check everywhere for keys or anything. Again, you can see it's very primitive right now. Same textures, very basic, but the uh, premise is good. And it's definitely got its freakiness. Sounds like so 
on me. This one is a bit chunky. Yeah, he's still there. Maybe we can get a shot on him. Got them both. All right. Clips come out from over the shoulder. Just hold it in place. Let go. Grab it with the trigger. Pull back and let go. There we go. I think part of what we needed was a photo. Let's get a photo of two dead men. That should help. So you hold the camera up to your face. The left stick will align the two panes of the images. Object detected. And there we go. We've completed our objective. The photo, uh, I mean, the camera is kind of quite nice looking. Like I say, this game has got a huge amount of potential. I'm a big fan of this small title right here, folks. You should uh, go pick up Uber Laufer right now. But let's move along. So, grab enemies. You can see a search bar comes up. And we can pick up what he's got. Typically, I find the officers have got better stuff. Ration car. Sometimes they've got clips for the gun. We've got a few things like that. So these little hidey holes are strategically placed in hallways for you. And that's the that's how you move around as stealthily as possible. So for my gameplay, I'm looking for cages. I'm looking for prisoners. In the cages, sometimes you will see other objects that are worth it, but uh, you need to use up expendable silver keys to open every one of those doors. So, okay. treasure chest. That's where we're going to find coins and goodies. Coins. Two coins. Now coins can be used and you can uh, grab coins and that'll give you ten coins by using the grab button. Those coins can be thrown bounced off walls, thrown down a hall, and they're noisemakers and they'll pull in uh, a soldier and confuse them for a minute, you might be able to get a kill. But let's climb on up and get these goodies. This game has some of the best climbing detection I've seen so far, but in the last update it needs a little hop because it seems when you grab an object it releases the uh, climbing hand. See, yeah. That's okay. That'll be hot fixed out right away, I'm sure. Whoops. Maybe it's hand dependent. Oh, it is. Interesting. So, if you hold on, <laughs> if you hold on with the right hand, you can do it and not fall. Those sirens have nothing to do with us as players. Come on now. All the background noise and stuff, the atmosphere in this game is unbeatable, I love it.
so you have to be careful to quickly kind of like move the bodies, get them out of the way, get them out of sight. I think found. Let's throw him in the hole. Goodbye. Yeah, even though this is an early access title, the gameplay and AI are already kind of showing that this can go a long way. There's somebody coming down the hall. guys in this area real quick. That's great. Oh. Somebody else is here. methamphetamine. Save that for later. <coughs> There's somebody on the other side of this wall. Okay, let's just quietly room will blast him. Here he comes, here he comes. It's an officer. Here is a Leiche. Here is a Leiche. Gotcha, buddy. Yeah, something's wrong here. I think that's what he was saying in German. Nothing. These levels can be massive. Gold key, tactical map, military magazines. Alright. Let's just go over here where... Can I 
officer came from. So we got a lot of guys here and there may be... Ooh, that doesn't look good. Oh. Okay, this is where that officer was that we could hear. Silver key. Excellent. That'll allow us to free a prisoner if we find one. Military magazine. That's what we're looking for, I think. Yep. magazine. Resistance dossier member information. The one thing about this game, this information, these kind of real stories can be used, and there's tens of thousands of them, they're amazing. Think that's an object we need? No. It's just something. Thank you. 
gets full, the SS shows up, and the SS is a guy with a mask on and a machine gun or something. He's much worse. So I'm going to have to have bullets for him. Maybe I can use this bottle. is coming now. It's in the red. That means I've got SS problems. I'm not sure if he's just like created and summoned right where I am. Es 
Genesis. Yep. And he's super accurate. How much health that gives me? in unserem Bereich. Bei Sichtung abschießen. Oh, right to the last bullet. Fucking lucky. Ich hab ihn oh. gefunden. No. Maybe not that lucky. It's getting low. And I don't know if the SS like go away at some point or whether you're just dead. Oh, that looks like the room we gotta get to right there. I still don't know the gold key. Kontakt. Ich habe ihn gefunden. Feindlicher Kontakt. German Nazi fucking prison to ruin your day. Schlaf, Mann, schlaf, Mann, schlaf, Mann, dass du morgen wachen kannst. Schlaf, Mann, schlaf, Mann, schlaf, Mann, dass du morgen wachen kannst. Very good, very good. 